Severe Acute Respiratory Syndrome, or SARS, originated in southern China in 2002. The infection quickly spread to other countries and resulted in 774 deaths worldwide. Researchers and virologists originally thought the SARS virus came from cats, but further research suggested that it came from bats, who transferred it to cats, and then from cats to humans. Symptoms in the SARS virus can include high temperature, headache and fatigue, coughing, shortness of breath and difficulty of breathing due to pneumonia and its sore joints. Symptoms usually appear three to seven days after exposure to the SARS virus. SARS is an airborne virus, which means it is spread in a similar way to influenza and the common cold. The SARS virus is spread in small droplets of saliva coughed or sneezed into the air by an infected person. Infection can occur if someone else breathes in the droplets. There is currently no cure for SARS, but research to find a vaccine is ongoing. Robert Koch a German physician and scientist discovered bacterium that cause tuberculosis, TB. Tuberculosis is spread from person to person through the air in tiny microscopic droplets. When a person with TB in the lungs coughs or sneezes, the bacteria can be inhaled by persons nearby. It was commonly believed in the 19th century that pure air could treat tuberculosis. American doctor John Crokin even set up a tuberculosis hospital in a cave because he believed that unique air would cure his patients. There are variants of the TB bacterium that infect cattle. Milk was known to transmit the disease from cattle to humans. Streptotoncin, PAS and Isonazid became available. When taken in combination and for a sufficient length of time, the prognosis for the patient with TB disease changed from dismal to the expectation of cure.